Hey my loves, it's Ariel. Today I'm coming to you guys with my February favorites 2023. If you guys are new to my channel, make sure that you guys go in ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. Don't forget to like, comment, make sure that you guys go in ahead and turn on those post notifications so you guys can become a part of my hashtag quick love gang. Also, if you guys aren't following your girl on any of her socials, make sure that you guys go in ahead and follow me. So I have to say, there's really not that many items that I loved for the month of February, but I just still decided that I really wanted to share these items with you guys. Most of the items are more geared towards like smell goods and hygiene items. Just going ahead and get straight into it. Let's go ahead and start off with the one and only beauty item that I have to share is the Fenty Beauty by Rihanna Stunna Lip Paint. Now. I actually came across this on Instagram when I saw like on the Fenty page that Rihanna had did like a little video of her putting on this lippy and when I saw that I was like this is the perfect shade that I've been looking for like you know how like people always make like cute lip combos where they usually put on a lip liner and then they put on like a lipstick and then a gloss or whatever or make like these really super cute lip combos that give you like those pretty nice brown lips that's like perfect for fall or like a night out so the shade is unveil and it is like the perfect chocolate shade so beautiful now i'm gonna be honest with you guys i did not use this on myself at all for the month of february but i decided to throw this in here because i forgot to throw it in my january favorites um, because I did wear this a couple of times in January. Absolutely love the packaging on this, the shape of the bottle. It just looks so classy. And then it says Fenty Beauty going down. Love that. Take it apart. Like, just look how nice this is. Now, I'm not going to do a swatch or anything with this. But if you guys see, like, my outro where, like, I have, like, my makeup on or whatever. And I have, like, a chocolate shade on my lips that's what you're seeing absolutely love this and it's not drying it's a matte lipstick but it's not drying at all i can literally wear this with a gloss on top or not when i wore this i wore it by itself i definitely want to try some more of the other shades that are a part of this collection let's go ahead and get into the smell goods and hygiene and all of that so the next item that i have for you guys is a deodorant now, I recently just started getting into Dove deodorant, I want to say about a year and a half ago, maybe two years now. And I've always used like this, I'll put it on the screen because I can't even think of the name of it or like the scent of it. But it had like the little green top on it. But when I went to the store, I needed to get some more deodorant and I usually like to get the twin pack of deodorant and they usually only have a twin pack in two kinds and one of them is the one I'm going to show you and then the other one that I usually get but they didn't have it. So I was like, you know what, let's switch it up and get a different one and see how I like it and let me just say I love this scent surprisingly but it is the Dove Advanced Care and this is the dry spray. And it's in the scent Caring Coconut. And this is just how the packaging looks. Usually all of Dove spray bottles usually look like this. And they have like a certain color top on them or whatever. Or like a certain color along here. Now I'm not really a huge coconut fan. Literally when it comes to like eating anything coconut. Or the smell of anything coconut. The only time I really like things that has like a coconut scent in it is like when I'm fresh out the shower. I really like to smell like that coconut beachy scent. Really love that when I'm fresh out the shower. Absolutely love the scent of this. I feel like the scent of this is actually stronger than the one that I had before. Because I kid you not, after a long day of work, I'm like moving my arms. I keep doing is getting whiffs of like a light scented coconut and it just smells so good. Now let's go ahead and get into some scents that I have for you guys perfume wise and one lotion, okay? So the first lotion I have for you guys is by Bath and Body Works and it's called Beach Nights. 
absolutely love the packaging on it the packaging on this is just so cute and the fragrance notes on this is toasted marshmallow sea salt breeze s'mores accord beach driftwood and creamy vanilla usually if a scent has like that nice vanilla scent in it i'm all about that absolutely love this and i've recently been trying to get into like pairing different things together just to see like how they smell and if i like it and recently i've been loving to pair this lotion from bath and body works with this english laundry perfume by christopher wicks absolutely the best combination ever this scent right here like a fruity floral i don't know if you guys ever heard of this i actually got this perfume in like a set of four there was like four different fragrances in there and this is just how the bottle looks it's really it's like a small bottle but i mean super cute and beach nights is like mm, you really smell that vanilla so mixing that vanilla with this like floral this like floral fruity with vanilla like so the next fragrance that i have for you guys also came along in the set with that other one that i just shared with you guys but this one right here is the english laundry oxford blue once again the packaging is really similar to the other one that i shared with you guys but it's a different color now this one is for sure like a stronger scent a bit on the musk side i have no clue what the notes are on this but if i can find out what they are i'll go ahead and put them on the screen as well for the other ones so the last fragrance that i have to share with you guys today is actually actually from one of my recent purchases that i made back in december and i don't know i just went like walking around the mall and i went in alta sephora macy's because you know they have like a huge big like you know fragrance outlet in there and I was just taking pictures of a bunch of stuff that I really liked because I was just looking for a fragrance that's like different from other stuff that I already have, already own. So I went ahead and picked this up. Plus at the time, Sephora had like had a 20% off discount for fragrances. This is the Valentino Born in Roma. This is the Coral Fantasy one. Now I have to say, this perfume is really strong a little bit goes a long way the initial scent of it you get like this strong strong manly scent like a strong musk but once you put it on and it sets in for a while you get like this fruity scent of like orange or tangerine or something in it once again i'll go ahead and put the fragrance notes on there for you guys so that you can kind of understand what i'm talking about this is the perfume bottle i just think that this is so cute it's classy i really like the shape of it and it kind of has like you know like these little spikes around there like the packaging of this is just so cute and the last thing i have to share with you guys for this month's favorite is a tv show and it is the walking dead absolutely love the walking dead i used to watch it years ago to sit down and wait for it to come on tv every single sunday that it came on but after a while when they killed off uh, one particular person they killed off i had kind of stopped watching it and then i heard that hey like i think i stopped watching either at season seven or eight one of those two but i heard that it was like really good and i heard that the show was getting better and it was also including some things that like you know like bringing back like good walking dead like the walking dead was always good but like it was just bringing back some good stuff from like the beginning if that makes sense but i started watching it i want to say in like january i just went ahead and restarted from season one the very first episode which i've seen a bunch of the seasons and episodes multiple times but i was like you know what let me just go ahead and start from the very beginning so i could like get to the point where i left off kind of get like a refresher and then finish off the show but i absolutely love that show go on ahead and let me know down below in the comments do you guys love the walking dead have you watched it 
Have you stopped watching it because they killed off one of your favorite characters? Or do you plan on watching it again? All right, you guys. So that's it for today's video. If you guys like the mission, you guys go on ahead and give it a big thumbs up. Go on ahead and let me know in the comments below with some things that you've been loving for the month of February. Don't forget to like, comment, make sure that you guys turn on those post notifications. Follow your girl on all of her socials. I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. No,